Hi guys, I'm just gonna show you my uh, full AFK build for Chaos 7. Um, I'll try and explain what's going on as, uh, as we go. So, um, <clears throat> I don't use uh, weapon manufacturers because the deal cost is too high. Um, flame auras are cheaper and then cannons are significantly stronger than the weapons manufacturer. They just, you just have to be careful with the, uh, the geodes, but the two flame auras kill the geodes just fine. And then after that, you get the benefit of higher DPS from the cannons. Um, I recently found a little trick on how to deal with siege rollers AFK. And that trick is the um, the surprise shard for the uh, uh, geyser geyser trap, which is why I put geysers at all the walls. All right. Uh, this build pretty much works on all of the C seven maps. Uh, you have to change it up a little bit, like depending on the map. I'm probably going to release videos for each different C7 map. If I get around to it. <laughs> for the... Uh, Geyser Trap, you're going to want to focus on um, defense power. So everything that raises the Geyser Trap's defense power is what you want. The critical doesn't do anything. I've, I've tried um, power transfer, it didn't do anything. So the more power you have, the stronger that the surprise shard damage um, gets. And then that's the only thing that really does damage to the siege roller. So, yeah, just uh, focus all on power. Get your highest power medallion, put uh, destruction, and put um, vampiric, uh, vampiric whatever it's called, in there. That way you get the highest amount of power, and then the shard will, or the, yeah, the shard will get empowered, and then it'll do about third or a half of the sea trollers health and damage and that looks like it's the end of the build uh, cannons here you're, you're gonna want the heavy cannonball shard and the, a rate shard so you can crank out the you can crank out the DPS and the stuns basically the cannons uh, serve two purposes they stun <clears throat> they keep the siege rollers stunned a little bit so they don't just tear up the the walls and they kill they kill bosses basically so all right enjoy